President Rodrigo Duterte led the distribution of cash subsidy to Cebuano beneficiaries in Cebu City yesterday. In his speech, Duterte promised a harsher crackdown on drug personalities. Here's Romain Rivera for the details. Around 1,000 listahanan identified unconditional cash transfer beneficiaries received their cash aid at the Cebu Technological University main campus gymnasium yesterday. President Rodrigo Duterte, in coordination with the Department of Social Welfare and Development and the Land Bank of the Philippines, led the distribution of the 200 peso subsidy per month or a lump sum of 2,400 pesos for the entire 2018. The UCT is a subsidy to the poor to mitigate the adverse effects of the new tax law. It will be given on the first three years after the Tax Reform for Acceleration and Inclusion or TRAIN law is implemented. Among the beneficiaries of the program are members of the Pantawid Pamilya Filipino Program, Social Pension Program, and Listahanan, a DSWD database identified beneficiaries. For the year 2019 and 2020, the beneficiaries will receive over 300 pesos a month or 3,600 pesos every year. Meanwhile, Duterte, in his speech, reiterated his promise to get rid of drug pushers and drug lords before the end of his term. The president added he would also punish officials of the Philippine National Police and Philippine Drug Enforcement Agency if found to be involved in the illegal drug trade. Duterte said if he had his way, any drug personality deserves to die by firing squad or hanging as punishment. Romain Rivera, Newsbits Tonight.